We have been following dozens of shootings, both here in the mid-state and across the nation. And a Nashville nonprofit is offering help to the survivors of those shootings. Yeah, it's called the On-Site Foundation. News 4's Jolene Bukovac shares the story of a Columbine High School shooting survivor who went through the program and is now helping others. It's one of the deadliest school shootings in U.S. history. When I was 16 years old, it felt like life was over. Crystal Whitman Miller was one of the students at Columbine High School the day of the shooting. At a point where life felt like it should just be beginning, it felt like everything was taken. 12 students and a teacher were shot and killed. April 20th, 1999 is a day Miller will never forget. And because of, of people that came alongside of me, because of great therapy, um, I was able to put one foot in front of the other and to find reasons to hope and to find reasons to heal. In 2020, Miller joined a Nashville-based nonprofit called the On-Site Foundation. It has a program called Triumph Over Tragedy, a retreat for shooting survivors. And I think that's what I'm so grateful. I'm in a place now 23 years later after the shootings at Columbine where I've walked through the fire and I get to walk out of that fire with buckets of water, you know, so to speak, and help those who are just starting the process. She's helping other shooting survivors through the Onsite Foundation's retreat, which has been digital up until now. On June 2nd, people from all over the country will travel to Dixon County for the free retreat led by trauma therapists. If you think about the mass shootings we've had over the last 25 years, there's hundreds of thousands of survivors that need help. And there's just not a whole lot of resources out there for them. So we just hope that we can be that safe space for survivors to come to find hope and healing. Joylyn Bukovac, News 4, Nashville. What a great